I'm going to show you how to search NFTs using the blockchain API. So uh, there are thousands and thousands of NFTs on Solana. Uh, you might want to be able to search them uh, by different attributes. So that could be by name, um, symbol, creator, etc. Um, so currently uh, we support at blockchain API uh, the following things, the following uh, searchable attributes and in the future as we grow we're gonna uh, we can definitely make this endpoint a lot better in terms of speed and other attributes you can search so if you have suggestions suggestions please join our discord uh, and submit them there and also uh, email us so here's what you can search the update authority that's usually the person who originally created the NFT the mint address of the NFT uh, that's no you know generally there's not a reason to search this it's just a thing we offer but you might as well just get the metadata because the mint address only brings up one nft okay the name the uri you know so it begins with this uri or it exactly matches this one the symbol and the uh, yeah and, th and that that's that's just you know which network you want to search mainnet bit or devnet okay so let's just do this really quick so we're going to be using the python wrapper so um it's pretty easy, uh, you know, you just have to install it. So there's a lot of, um, we have a, other wrappers for other languages. It's pretty, uh, you know, Go, Java, et cetera, JavaScript here. And then, you know, if you want an example for that respective language, they're all here in these C examples. So uh, you could just go there uh, and check it out. Okay, so um, I'm going to uh, first now initialize the resource, so from the blockchain API import. So sorry, by initialize the resource, I meant uh, sort of jumped in there. Basically, you need to uh, initialize this class for the Python wrapper. You don't have to do this for other wrappers uh, that has your API keys. And then from that, you can uh, set all of your, you can call all of the functions on this resource, right? So the other thing is if you don't have this installed, it's pretty easy, you just do pip install the blockchain API, or you can go to here and click interpreter settings, then the plus button, and then search up the blockchain API. Okay, so then we go over here, and this is going to be the function we want to call. So we can call search NFTs. Let's go symbol uh, equ uh, equals ban, I don't know, and simple search method. So you want to import the search method from here. So uh, yeah. Uh, whoops. Do begins with. Okay, result, and then this is going to be an array for so for item in result, print item. So first, we're just going to run this. This is going to throw an exception because we don't have valid API keys. So let's just start with that. Okay, so um, now we have to get the API keys to fill them in, and then we'll be done. So it's pretty simple. Once you're ready, you go to dashboard.blockchainapi.com, create API key pair, and then put it in here. Okay, and now let's search. Great, so it returned all of the NFTs that match this, which should have counted them, but all right, so let's see. Bang Kid, see how that matches the ban? This begins with ban. Um, actual ban. Bang kid, ban, banana, expected at least one with banana. Um, banner, bandit. Okay, so this is actually, if you see there's a ton here, right? One thing I didn't mention is that the network here is on DevNet. So you want to, the default is DevNet. So let's try mainnet really quick. So see, I can do DevNet here or mainnet here. Mainnet beta, same thing as mainnet. So let's retry. So 
So yeah, currently this call does take some time. So you know, if it if it takes too long for your use case or anything, please let us know, and we'll we'll um, we really operate based on feedback we get. So what you say is uh is important. So if you need this to be faster, let us know. Yeah, this is there it is great so a um, couple things one is um, see this pub key hash uh, that you can use for verifying the collection if it's a collection that you're uploading um, but anyways now we have all of them these are on mainnet see bank bank so there must be a big collection with bank right B A N C. but yeah, no we don't note that I don't see that um, bang kid or whatever that other one was on devnet so that was probably never uploaded. See, we have a big collection here with bank, B A N C, right? That's almost all of them, which I didn't even know existed. So actually, if we go to Magic Eden, uh, let's see if uh, huh? Okay, what is the name here? I want to see if we can find the collection. Symbol Bank. What is the name? Oh, these don't have names. Okay. Test launch my NFT. Okay, so maybe it's just not ready yet. Um, Board Ape Not Club. Huh. So this must not be. I mean, they they already minted all of these on on uh, mainnet, which cost them at least a couple thousand. So they seem somewhat serious about it. Um. Anyways, that's how you search NFTs. Thanks for listening. You know, and the other thing, yeah, you know, yeah, you can also, you know, add in name here, etc. Name, update, search authority. You know, just make sure you know what the defaults are. You know, so the name search method, I think the default is exact match, right? So you want to make sure to put in name search method, um, etc. And then if you want to search by other things, let me know. All right, thanks.